today we are in Soho and we're going to look at a little bit of vintage luxury goodness. Okay, so we're going to go into what goes around comes around, see what's new, what's happening. Guys, if you're new here, my name is Cassie and I'm a self-diagnosed luxury addict. I put out videos on Mondays, Wednesdays and Fridays, so if you like luxury fashion, then you're probably gonna love it. So don't mess subscribe to the bell, become a member of our luxury addicted family. When are we going to rehab? Never. Links are going to be below or in the shopping button on the screen. First of all, I want to show you the windows because they've just redone things for spring. Botanical and green, and I hope you can see even the reflection of the windows. And then I want to show you this one, this dress. Oh my gosh. I need to know, is it Cavalli? It's giving me Cavalli vibes. Look at the ruffles. It makes me want to be on a beach. Let's go in. Store is looking fabulous. Let's see what they've got. Little pochettes, little wallets and whatnot. Oh, I have never seen this, the um, material of it, like the metallic very nice okay also i think that they've now started to get like some vivian westwood stuff oh very frankensteinian frankensteinian <laughs> i think that that should be a word little silk gautier number very spring summer this oh look at the arms this with a pair of jeans floating through the streets oh my gosh what is that chanel boutique Bergdorf Goodman on the Plaza New York. What? I've never seen a label like that. That's amazing. Do we have an idea? Collection? 23, like 23rd collection, because this looks old. Let's see if the tag tells us anything. 4,500. Oh, another Versace jeans couture. This was a print that they redid for their H&M collection, if I am not mistaken. Oh, one very similar. Oh, I like that. Little nylon Prada jacket in the blue. Look who's interesting. Lots of these. The Murakami pochettes. Look at that little Murakami bag as well. That's nice. Some newer things. The Gucci Diana. That's new. Look at how fabulous this is. I love this. The white denim would be dead in a day. But I love the butter yellow against it. Like this colour combination is fabulous. She is giving a day at the races. Or also a day to see to meet one's mother-in-law. Is this an orange Versace suit? <gasps> Made in Italy tag. Oh my gosh, look at that. Look at the trim. Wow, that is just what a cute this is very the nanny isn't it you you know that tv show i've actually never seen it but i've seen pictures of the woman on it and she looks to be dressing fabulously fendi satiny jacket oh my gosh okay i am going to have to try on some things oh my gosh i love this look at this little twin set with the tiny are you seeing the tiny medusa buttons stop that's so cute and then what's this? It's just, just like a little tank, a little tank that goes with it. Is that not so cute? And just like, look at the tiny pockets. What would you put in there? Absolutely nothing. But I like her. Ooh, we have a Mugler. Mugler with the chain under the, uh, under the, under the titties. Just like the labels of the things. When is that from? Look at that Dior label. With the lace on the lapels. Christian Lacroix, RIP, no longer even a brand. There is also something about this that I love. This Jean Paul Gaultier, again, this frilly little top with a little bralette and a pair of shorts and off you go. Live your very spring summer life, no? With the hot pink and the little, I don't even know what pattern that is, but it's giving me a smile on my face, and truly, sometimes that's all that matters. This perforated Chanel buckety tote. And the bowler bag. Fantastic. Look at these little Louis Vuitton pedal pushes. Oh my gosh. I, could, I mean, they're absolutely minuscule, but they're very fun. Well, you're not surprised. It has a logo on it. This shirt, however, I'm obsessed with. Whom, whom is it by? It's a beautiful fabric as well. Look at it go up. It's giving Pirates of the Caribbean. You know I like this vibe. You know I like this Victoriana moment. Who makes you? 
Jean-Paul Gaultier, you know, walking into a tavern in the in the 1800s. Oh, just a little uh, belly exposure. I'm obsessed with it. More vintage Chanel and Carl era Chanel. This will always be on my forever wish list, the milk carton. I love all those like crazy minodiers. Shh, look at her. Oh my gosh, is this like technically a papillon? I think this is a papillon, but this is the Murakami one. Oh my gosh. This is so cute. With the little, with the little cherry blossoms. Saying hi, do you see if they have tiny faces? They have tiny faces and they're extremely happy to see you. She's very interesting, I'm intrigued by her. With the sort of suede inside leather outside. And then, oh, the little Valentine's Day charm version. This skirt. Vivian Westwood. Denim skirt. Oh, I like that. She is a little low-waisted, which you know is not me, but... Oh my gosh, how good does that top look on the model? But I love it. Okay, I said that I've sworn off denim skirts, but this to me is not technically a denim skirt. You know the denim skirts I'm talking about. The ones that are extremely close to the body for no reason. I mean, obviously, the only downside is this is a Celine denim dress. Excuse me. Is it a coat? Is it a dress? My gosh. Anyway, the only, you know, downside to um, vintage clothing is the sizing. You know, you really are only given the one option. Don't pretend like you're surprised. Okay, actually, no, I am surprised because I wasn't ready for the tweed bit at the bottom. Here we were doing great, here not so much. Okay, we move on because I do see another another friend who is maybe more up my alley. You know I love like this PVC-ish coated monogram jacket. It's absolutely perfect for the rain. <laughs> Slinky number, what is this one? Fendi for Bergdorf, my gosh. Talk about mob wife aesthetic. I want this foliage in this seat in my home. Is that too much to ask for? Look at this little corset, this Cavalli corset. I'm also really happy at the amount of Cavalli in here. This bag I have a soft spot for, don't ask me why. I like the fact that it looks distressed. Honestly, the models are killing it. I would never, I would never have looked at this skirt, but this, with this then interesting top draped on top, what? With them, the Chanel belt as a necklace? Who are you by? Comme de Garçon, 2006, 2500. But it also says it's a set. So I think that maybe that comes with the skirt. Oh my gosh. That's very cool. Oh, look at the Birkin wall. Just a rainbow of them. Taunting us with their fabulousness. Me and this model are matching today in our double denims. She doesn't know it. Mm. Oh my gosh, with the chain mail arms, dear me. Hold on. Okay, this gives me, this is Paco Rabanne. I have a very, <laughs> does anybody remember in uh, School of Rock, a spider? I feel like this is very similar to the, well, it's the reverse of the jacket that he was wearing at the um, Battle of the Bands, but it does make me think of that. That's a very specific reference. I will include photos so that I don't sound insane. Okay, look at that little Versace corset with the little Medusa on the strap. Very, very cute. Aha, uh -huh. some more exotic Chanel's over here. Crocodile and whatnot. Also, if anybody's in the market for a Louis Vuitton surfboard, that is available. I really like this one because it's very sort of like simple, easy, everyday. I love the baguette buckle just swinging over the top. You've got three different sections. I just think that that's just perfect condition. It almost feels a bit neoprene actually. And then you've got some more Fendi Zucker including. For those who are brave, paint your own baguette. I could simply never be trusted. It would look absolutely horrendous. Nobody should put me in this position because it will ju I will just cry because I wouldn't even be able to use it because it would be that hideous. This is a cute one as well. Oh, I like how like, you know, She's nice and sizable from the side. She's cute. 
And then this little toad. Oh, with her little FFs. If I say Liberty X, this is a Liberty X outfit. Do you understand what I mean? Also, hold on. I mean, you know she's not one for the big bags, but how have I never seen of your existence? Also, this is, ooh, do you see how it's like not smooth metal? And then there's the little CCs on the, that's, okay. I may need to snatch this off your arm to just have a try so that we can all see. Oh my gosh. This is Dior. Look at its furry little snake snaking around the body. It is sadly too tight on the arms of all places. Oh my gosh. But it also has this like very interesting sort of stripe. The way it's woven is a little bit different. This is fabulous. Like this, this is the woman who is just shuffling downtown, living her very best life, okay? And she can be trusted in white. She will gladly wear this with a coffee in hand because she is a woman who is simply put together, okay? Coffee spills and things of that sort do not happen to a woman who wears this jacket. What, are you kidding me? She maybe even has a tiny dog that is the exact same as this fluff, okay? Just like a little one, she's here. She knows she's fabulous, but she doesn't take liberties with it. She has the confidence in her fabulousness, but she's not cocky. I'm, I'm going far too far on the description of this woman, but I'm just telling you, she's great. Look at the tiny little pockets here on the little tank top, which by the way, fits perfectly. How dare you? And then this cute little perfectly matching cardigan with the tiny Medusa button. Is it too girly girly for me? We are here with Lydia, who's going to talk us through her faves currently. Yes. So these are my faves that we have in the store. We just got some of these this week. Oh my gosh. I am a huge Galliano collector. Anything John Galliano era Dior, specifically Rasta. Yes. I Love Caribbean music, reggae, soca, love the vibes. Expect all of this for my art. Why does it match your outfit today? I, <laughs> I should have carried this today. Exactly. Um, these are really hard to find in pristine condition. Mm -hmm. This is an impeccable condition and these never last. We just got this this week. Oh my gosh. I also, so you know what? I'm always surprised at how wide they are because it looks like a much smaller bag, yeah. you know, like first off, but yeah. you're getting a lot in there. Oh no, you can fit so much in here. Yeah. This oh, it does look good with this outfit. It is a great, just like, chunky little bag run around oh look Everyone at the knows. razzle dazzle the razzle dazzle the carry moment yes sex in the city yeah i love also how there is some sort of like pattern with these but i like how it doesn't look so obvious mm -hmm. because it just catches the light in an exactly. interesting way oh wow so i've been here almost four years yeah I've never seen this. That color is so good. Never ever seen this. Look how rich the hot carat, pink is. Gold plated hardware from the 90s. If I had to guess, this is from 89 to 91. The condition is insane. Pristine condition, hot fluorescent pink satin. I mean, this is what they should have had in the Barbie movie. Come on. Literally. What? Margot Robbie needs this. Yes, she Margot does. Margot Robbie, if you're watching. <laughs> We this want... is a true collector's piece. And I also love how rich the gold hardware is against the hot pink. Because mm -hmm. she is just loud and statementy and fabulous. Yep. Oh. A military jacket. Yeah. A boucle. Mm, little CC. We'll see on the end. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's give it a go. Try it. Oh, it's so good. Stop. It fits we did really well. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> this is so good. It's so good. So this is the Paris Limited, two-tone, 24 mm -hmm. karat gold plated with the silver. This was only released at the Chanel store in Paris for a few years in the 90s. My mouth is hanging open. It's so interesting it's with so this little, <gasps> wait, and this is this meant to mimic the joining of the CCs? Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, the attention to detail that is definitely lacking today. What? Oh, and look at that as well. Yeah vertical lines never in my life literally lined in burgundy leather mm -hmm. 
with all of your little pouches and everything. Good that one. with the two tone is and they just don't really so do different. That. No. Anymore at all. Every so often you'll see a silver, a you know, that kind of thing, but not a two tone. Not a two -tone. We're here with Mary and Christian. Uh, and your new favourite jumper. I've seen you in this twice in the last week. Which is not a bad thing. It means that you really love it. In all fairness, I think I've worn it two more times in, in there. I really have. Uh, yeah, it's it's. I'm obsessed with it. And then Mary is in the market for a Takashi Murakami black multicolor. So let's see if there's something for her today. Like certain colors. Yeah. Like one of mine has colors in the front, and it bothers me every time I wear it. I do like this. Oh, did they not make the colors in the same? So they, wherever they cut the leather on yeah. the Murakami collection, it's cut differently. So like, I specifically like these colors, so I always look for bags where they have those colors across the front. Oh. Ah. Because every single one is not the same. Yeah. Wow. Um, oh, as I never a knew. Murakami collector. I think yes. it's too girly for you. I now. think it is, yeah. I like, I like, the, you know why? Because I like the metal corners. Yeah. I mean, Ooh. I know. I, I love this double pocket on Me that. too. That's like how mine is. It's oh, identical to mine. I didn't know that. It's cool when people wear it like two. <laughs> I mean. Bitch, mm -hmm. you know, it's like the rarest. Sure. Like every time I carry mine, I get stopped on the street. No. It's in perfect condition. It's so hard to find. And sometimes they come in without this, which really. Yeah. Oh, interesting. This you want because it says Takashi Murakami. Uh -huh. and okay. Everything you need. Madam? With her new fabulous bag purchase. Hello. I am obsessed with it. Rihanna was re was recently carrying this in Aspen. And apparently she got it from here. And I'm obsessed. And what's the damage? Okay. Okay, so... Hmm. Gosh, this is just incredible. A liar. Vintage liar with the waist. Oh my gosh. Also, how cute is this little satin outfit with the with the layers and layers of Chanel chains? What is that? It's huge! Oh my gosh, you have to be like six foot seven for it to hit at a normal height. For it to not drag on the floor. Wow. Filling this up though, like it's gonna be so heavy. It's already heavy. Like what are you putting in there? You know what, actually, this has been to my detriment to come into what goes around. Oh, look at that! This mustard little... Hold on, because I like that the strap... Okay, so they've tied the strap, but it's like a little shoulder strap. Little mustard moment with the little Chanel pull. Look at this! Do we not like this little fellow? I thought you were trying to ask. Yes, oh, I was. That's really cute. I know! I like the pockets, I like the canvas of it. You want to know what? If this was an animal, it would be a frog. Do you know what I mean? Well, it, because it's um, it's a bit rotund. Yes, <laughs> yes, exactly. Because it's like a little bit short and stout and it's mm -hmm. green. <laughs> exactly. This is very cute. Oh, I know, I and like that's it. his tongue. <gasps> it is a frog. It's a frog. Look at the silk shirt. Ooh, this Gucci silk shirt with like the loafers on it that's great very Alyssa with the shoulder kelly the vintage one in this red i need this this is so good are these your faves courtney yes this is one of my favorites oh wait hold on pinch i love the trunk oh and it has all of 24 the years mm -hmm. louis vuitton japan and it has the nice oh box. my gosh Look, with everything. Mm -hmm, mirror. And then what would one put in all of these sections? I mean, you can, it depends on what you uh, want to travel with, but. And you can manipulate it. Aha, uh -huh, so one can be bigger, one can be smaller. Oh my gosh. That, I wish to be a woman with a trunk. You know, yeah. like that's something that needs to be ticked off in like the to-do list of life. Yes, I can yeah. definitely see you with a trunk. I know. Yes. You could fit inside of it. This is yeah. the <laughs> literally one. I just, I told Stephanie, I was like, I want a But this is a vintage one. Oh, so the lock is ginormous. Mm -hmm. Oh, that looks so good. And this one's from 1997. So this is the year Margiela was a designer for it. Okay. So this one's a really good one. And I love that sort of aged mm -hmm. um, hardware on it as well. And it looks better relaxed when you wear it. Yeah. 
Imagine getting onto a flight. You'll be in seat 27C <laughs> and you will be lugging that that HAC up in <laughs> Not 27C. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're, you're At least you're in the aisle. <laughs> wow. My gosh, it's huge. You know, this is the size of most New York apartments. <laughs> this is a studio. <laughs> Christian, you need this. But you know what I what you don't need is two kidneys. So you can get rid of one and then sell it. To fund that. Yeah. There we go. It's all about necessity. Like yeah. Yeah. This, yeah. This, this your next bag. Yeah. You see, my issue is, if I were to have this, there would just be like one thing rolling around at the bottom. <laughs> Underneath this. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> that is so nice. I just love the structure of it. Yeah. With the, say the vision. So, the vision. Yeah, the vision is the, the tightest of legging, mm -hmm. but crop. So, you know, obviously the like fingers are back, are coming back in, but like super tight, not like a... Like a little capri pant. Yes, exactly. Okay, yes. Um, and a palm. Love that. Yeah. And you, and you know me, I would choose a white palm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, do, do you want me to do my version of styling of this? Um, let me see if I can guess it. Okay. Baggy jeans and a trainer. It was going to be with a heel, okay. but thank you very much. Yes, I was like, <laughs> even this today with the jeans that I'm wearing and a little heel. <laughs> We're in the vault. Oh, oh. oh, look at this Versace. See, there's a TBE for everybody. And this is mine. <laughs> it's so cute. Look at this, the Chanel for hand muffs. Insane. Wait, who is this silk shirt by? An Hermes one. Love the colours. I don't even know. Do you know which game this is, Mary? Does that game ring a bell? It, it, Bachi? Is it? I, I don't know. I think so. I've, I've got no idea. I'm like guessing. Okay. Is this Bachi? Um, yes. Look at you! I'm I've never heard I'm of athletic. that in my life. I'm sporty. Oh my gosh. Look at these with the little studs of the lion and the heart and the clover and the camellia. That's so cute. I think this is more recent, this one. But I hope you enjoyed the video in general and that you saw some, some beautiful things. I'm going to leave a link to another video over here in case you haven't already seen it. Have an amazing morning, afternoon or evening wherever you are. And in the words of my father... If you've enjoyed it, tell your friends. If you haven't, keep your mouth shut. I'll see you in my next video. Mwah. Bye, guys.